Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am here with my wax picks for the month of December. I can't believe we're already like going into December. I don't know. I feel like, I don't know. It just flew by and then yeah, we have a little bit of snow here. Not too much, like probably a half inch maybe. Very light snow but we shall see if we get more later in the week but yeah i pulled some like i said in every kind of video that i you know wax picks video um i followed <laughs> i had a brain fart moment i follow different wax melt challenges so these are, I wouldn't necessarily say all winter scents, obviously. Um, I feel like I didn't pull as much. I'm kind of worried that I didn't pull enough. Um, so we shall see if I make another video later in the month of December. Um, yeah, to see if I need any more because I feel like I didn't pull as much as I usually do, but that's okay. It's, um, what's today say? November 29th right now. Probably won't upload this to like maybe the 30th. I'm not sure. Are there 30 days in November? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's get into the Silkies stuff because I do her melt challenges every month. Um, so there's no particular order like I said this is not all seasonal some is some isn't so it's just how it works out um, we have blackberry palo santo marshmallow fireside and these are all customs blueberry muffin french vanilla and starbucks coffee we have ron weasley which is orange crush soda poke cake teen cakes and toasted marshmallow we have prince princess peach Lemon curd, peach nectar, strawberry pound cake, and cotton candy frosting. Honey Dukes, which is cotton candy frosted cake, jelly beans, and lollipops. I cannot wait to melt that one. I feel like it's going to be so good. Uh, Remus Lupin, which is mom's chocolate chip cookies, brownie butter, and chocolate sugar cookies. Then we have Harry Potter, which I still am obsessed with like the coloring and the glitter on this. I'm I feel like I'm gonna have a hard time melting these Harry Potter customs that I did, but I just need to do it. So this one here is, sorry, there's like a fuzz on the label. All right, this one is lemon cookie, tea and cakes, and French baguette. Let me smell this one again because, mm, yeah, I love tea and cakes ones. And then that, lemon cookie just goes so well with the tea and cakes because it's like tea and cakes is like an orange almondy tea blend um so i love it so much next is cafe vienna some of these you probably have seen multiple times um this is from 2021 winter candy apple blended with christmas tree if you hear squeaking that's my chair um, roasted pine cones, smoked vanilla, and sugar cookies. French vanilla latte, sweet lavender, and coconut milk, a favorite. Coffee house, pumpkin caramel swirl, and toasted marshmallow. Blonde moment, strawberry soda, and key lime pie. Oops drop this one we have christmas morning brew some of these i uh named and some i didn't so this one is coffee house christmas cookies and peppermint mocha then we have peanut butter cookies strawberry jam cornbread and fresh baked bread hopefully i'm not going through these very quickly um this one here is not a custom and neither was Cafe Vienna. So this is Mimosa and Cardamom, which is the Joe Malone type. To me, that doesn't smell exactly like it. Um, the Bathing Garden has one, and I love that one, but I can't get it. So, um, but yeah, that doesn't smell like the dupe for me, to me. Um, so this one here is 
Sunday morning waffles, which is zucchini bread, blueberry muffin, pumpkin pecan waffles, and oop, Starbucks coffee. <laughs> Hang on, guys. All right, next up is, this one seems thicker. Wow, this is pretty thick compared to some of the other ones. Um, this one here is Christmas Memories, Balsam Cranberry Apple Orange Spice. This is amazing. Oh my gosh. This custom is probably one of my favorite customs I've done with her for winter scents. It is so... Oh my gosh. It is just so pretty and I, re I have already melted this and it's really strong and long lasting so I might have to pick up more of that in the future because that is just absolutely beautiful next is pumpkin pecan waffles starbucks coffee vanilla butter fudge some of these i plan to um finish this is hot cocoa and cream peppermint marshmallow let me smell this one again because to me i mean this is good but when i got her um hot cocoa and cream oil on its own it wasn't the exact dupe of bath and body works so i was really disappointed in that um, some of her dupes, I, I'm going to say this, some of her dupes aren't exact, um, so. Alright, next is Corn Husk. Um, Passion Fruit Guava Watermelon Fizzy Pops. Not the biggest fan of Fizzy Pops, it has to be blended right for me, and it's got to be like, it can't be the dominant note. Um, it's got to be like in the background, but I do enjoy it. Um, I think that's all. Oh, wait, nope. We got a couple more silkies. I think one more. I'm not sure. Um, Minerva McGonagall. This is caramel apples, buttery gingerbread, honey buttered rolls. Let me smell this one. Mmm, yeah. It is so good. So, so yummy. So, there is that. Now let's get into some vendor wax and some clamshells that I have. Oh my gosh, I wish this chair would stop being so squeaky. All right, this one is Teddy B's Sweetheart Cookies, pink sugar frosted sugar cookies, shortbread, birthday cake, and sweet milk. I have from Salem Soy. This is when it this was in a ass wax package I got at the beginning of this year. So this is from December of 2022. So candy cane, buttercream, and sugar cookie in the bag is so gross looking, but I know her wax is really soft and smudgy, so I mean, that's why, but there's a bunch of like sugar cookie shapes in here in a candy cane, and this smells so yummy. It smells like a candy cane sugar cookie. Next is strawberries and cream kettle corn. Um, frosted animal cookies from L3. This is a shape from Sassy Wax Melts in Diane's Scrumptious Blueberry Cobbler, which is rich blueberries, brown sugar, and pie crust. To me, this smells like blueberry cereal. Yeah, it smells like the blueberry cereal oil with some bakery, you know, pie crust and a little bit of brown sugar, but yeah. But I also can smell the undertone of her wax blend that she has. Next, also from Sassy Wax Melts, is Pepperberry Mistletoe. I got this last year when she was having that sale. I can't remember how much percentage off, but this is really pretty. It just smells like berries and like a pine tree type scent. So, excited to melt that one. We have from Pink Owl Wax, which is Apple Fritter Bakery, Apple Fritter, Sugar Cookies, Fresh Bakery Dough, and Cake Batter. If you like, if you like Rose Girl's Apple Fritter oil, you would really like this one, because it's very similar. So, to my nose. Next is Salty Apple. This is Salted Pretzel, Mac Apple, Caramel, and Caramel, Maple, and Sugar Cookie. Very strong scent. That was gifted to me. 
Let me do the ones that were gifted to me by my friend. my friend yummy sense all the things here on youtube she gifted me um those and also these next ones that i'm going to show this is britta's cornbread lemon curd vanilla bean marshmallow she gifted me deer camp which this is phenomenal i was so shocked that she didn't like it this is incredible fresh fallen leaves burning logs and a touch of dirt this to me smells like a Christmas scent. I don't know. It almost smells like it has some pine or a tree note in here. I'm not sure if it's coming from the, the logs or the fallen leaves. I really don't smell dirt in this at all. But I need another like full-size mini melter bag of this because it is really strong and it throws a very long time. So I'm going to be sad to melt this, but this is phenomenal. Then she sent me Jenny Cookie Therapy, which is fresh baked bread, brown sugar, and strawberry jam. Uh, kiwi Blossom. This is lavender martini and kiwi. One of the days is like melted kiwi scent, so that's what I have. She sent me this as well, Twisted Peppermint Cuppy Cake. Marshmallow Fluff Cupcakes at Tiffany's. This is Hollow Scream. This is so stinking good. Oh my gosh. This, oh, this is so good. It's like such a sweet marshmallowy peppermint bakery scent. Oh, it makes my mouth water. It smells almost like a Andy's Thin Mint because that Cupcakes at Tiffany's does have like a little tiny hint of chocolate in it so it's not as chocolatey as like an andy's mint but it's got that sweet kind of um sweet minty filling like a mint oreo oh my gosh it just it makes my mouth water <laughs> it's so so good and then she also sent me this one this is the last one I think she sent me out of this picks, yeah. Um, Country Blessings, and this is Simmering Potpourri Spices and Christmas Tree. Oh, this is beautiful too. I was so worried about the Simmering Potpourri Spices, but it's not spicy at all. It is beautiful. Ooh, it is really strong too. Oh gosh, that mint definitely cleared out my nose for me to smell other things. <laughs> um, then we have uh, this is also this is was in an ass wax bag too. Carbs from Rose Girls Cookies, Bread and Donuts. This on its own, really nice blender bakery. Um. The Teddy Bees one and this one was sent to me from um, Christine. When did she send this to me? I don't remember. Um, but that video is on my channel. Uh, this is the Melted Mousse, your My Jam, Blackberry Jam Butter Cookies, Lemon Curd, and Sugar Cookie. She also sent me the Teddy Little Teddy Bees pieces. And this one as well, which is Purple Haze from Vintage Chic, Jelly Donut, Gooey Marshmallow, and Zucchini Bread. This smells incredible. So that is all like the little friend gifts. And now, yeah, okay, let's get into the, um, more of my stash. This is Vanilla Cotton from Silkies. I forgot I threw this in there. Um, I have Mario Party, which is cut. Confetti cake, strawberry pound cake, fruit loops, and sugar cookies. One of the melt challenges is to melt a strawberry pound cake or sugar cookie blend. So I decided this one would be perfect. Fire Mario and Christmas Eve in Cookie Land. There's all the scent descriptions. Love that one. 
I actually really like Rose Girls Espresso. Um, it's really nice. Um, lavender Silk Laundry Day and Sweater Weather. Zucchini Pastries Country Cream and Pumpkin Crunch. These are all from that Smell Good Shop. The Amazing Rice Toasty Milo and Toasty Coconut. Baked Apple Bread, Cupcakes at Tiffany's, and Ice Cream Bread. And then we have two from Dessa's. So I'm excited to try these out. This is chestnuts ro roasting on an open fire. Chestnuts, brown sugar, sugar cookies, and marshmallow fireside. And then sugared zucchini strusso, which is... Sorry if it will focus. There we go. Zucchini bread, sugar cookie, cinnamon strusso crumble. And then we have um, from Southbound, Ghostly Brew, Spooky Blend of Cider Donuts and Vanilla Bean Noel. Now let's get into some of my, so, the clamshells that I picked. <laughs> I cannot speak today. Okay. From Yummer's Delight, I have Peppermint Dough, which is Peppermint Bark and Sweet Bakery Dough. I got this in 2021, December of 2021. Love that scent. Still smells amazing and strong. This one is strawberry ice cream sandwich. One of the days is melt a cupcake blend and this has strawberry cupcake, vanilla cone, and French baguette. That smells amazing. We have from Better Homes and Gardens, sugared marshmallow and cocoa. I'm gonna try and get through this. Um, ugh. I don't know why I got this one. I don't, it smells like Merry Mocha from last year. If you pick that one up um, in the Black Friday sale, they didn't do one this year, which was kind of disappointing. Um, but whew, this is disgusting. I might have to blend this with something, maybe carbs from Rose Girls. See how this does on warm first because Maybe this might not blend well with a certain bakery scent, so we shall see, but this is going to be a rough. <laughs> Let me know. Did you guys pick this one up from this year? This is definitely not a new scent. It is a repackage of, oh, I said it in my first video when I did this collection release. Why can't I think of the, I can't think of the name but it's a repackage of that. They do not do hot cocoa well. This is just nasty artificial chocolate. Blah. <laughs> All right, we have pumpkin cookies from, pumpkin cookies and milk from Southbound, which is fresh from the oven, pumpkin spice cookies with warm sweetened milk. We have Santa's Bake Shop. Caramel Nut Clusters. If you've seen my haul from this, from the Better Homes and Gardens Sensationals um, Winter Scents, the collection that I did, I wanna say two weeks ago, three weeks ago, I don't remember, a couple weeks ago, uh, you would know the scent descriptions. So this one here is Cinnamon Sugar Frosting, Warm Fall Sunshine, Pumpkin Snickerdoodle Swirl, Vanilla Spruce, this one, ugh, I really enjoy. It is so, so pretty. It's almost like a touch cologne -y. like fresh cologne kind of outdoorsy Christmas tree. Um, really like that one. Pine sap and clove. Mm, this smells like a repackage. Oh, this smells like... At, on cold sniff, it smells like a repackage of a scent that I used to love in 2014. Um, gosh, why can't I think of it? You know what? Hang on. Let me go get the package. Okay. Smelling them now, they don't smell anything alike. It, 
I don't know, this gave me a scent memory of this scent, but it's definitely not the same at all. I thought it was this one from 2014, Snowy Winter Woods. That kind of gave me the vibe of it, vibe of it, but this one, no, they're not similar at all. Maybe a little bit similar because I feel like this one is heavier on the clove note, this pine sap and clove. So if the clove was toned down, I feel like these would be pretty similar. I did use this one, um, but I it's, you could still smell it in the packaging because it was that strong. So definitely not the same, but I see where I could s smell the kind of similarities of that one. All right, back to this. Sorry, guys, I got sidetracked. Um, salted caramel cocoa. This has no hint of cocoa whatsoever in it, so that's disappointing, but we shall move on from that. Great grape waffle cone from the Bathing Garden. Uh, cinnamon crunch, sweetened cereal, marshmallows, sugary milk, cinnamon, and sugar cookies. This one used to be called Snape. From last year, we have white peppermint and mocha. And then we have coconut snow. And last clamshell is Christmas candy shop. Mm, this one is so, so pretty, but let me take it out. Yeah. Pepperminty, slight peppermint. I mean, you get that nose clearing effect. And then the berry. I don't smell anise. I don't smell licorice-y. I really don't smell cinnamon, um, but I like that one nonetheless. All right, I have a sample here from Yummers. This is coffee and a cookie, java and gingerbread. One of the days is melt a gingerbread blend, so there's that. Sample in a pineapple mango. All right, then we have Yummers Delight Scent Shots. So let me go through these. My all-time favorite scent, Book Weather. I love that one. White Birch, Madagascar Vanilla, Warm Sandalwood, and Java. <laughs> Holiday Wreath. This is Cinnamon, Spruce, Warm, and Inviting. And it definitely is. This is a beautiful holiday scent. Don't be afraid of the cinnamon note because it's not... You could smell it, but it's not spicy at all. It's just beautiful. I love it so much. So there is that one. Happy Little Camper. This one is fresh balsam. No, sorry. Fresh pine, balsam, and berries. We have fall snacking, which is popcorn, toasted marshmallow, molasses, and cinnamon. Love that one. Poolside Punch. This is Orange Sherbet and Blue Hawaiian. I don't remember the, the prompt for that one. I Hate Mondays. This is Vanilla Cone, Java, and Blueberry Muffins. This one, this challenge is melts something with the day of the week in the title or in the name. So we got Monday. Doesn't everybody hate Mondays? All right, three more sun shots and we shall be done. Sorry, I feel like I'm talking a lot in this video. Iridescent Clouds, which is Vanilla Bean Noel Spearmint and Cotton Candy. Love that. I love her cotton candy. You could definitely smell that cotton candy in there. My favorite sweater, with it, which is Bath & Body Works Sweater Weather Type. And last but not least is Cranberry Cobbler. And that is all for my picks for December. Um, hopefully I have enough to get through the days. If not, like I said, I'll come back and do another video and, you know, pick out some more stuff. So that is all for this wax picks video. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry, this is a hot mess. <laughs> But I appreciate you guys being here and sticking with me. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.